You know, there are alternate storage method methods for uh, cameras and lenses. This is one of them. I found um, new old stock. Somebody bought this back in the 80s, and it was in their closet. And I got it uh, for uh, 45 bucks. And, uh, well, shipping was $10. Um, here we go. What a better case to stick $10,000 of medium format GFX lenses in than a Zero Halliburton. Um, combination lock. There was actually a passenger liner in the 1980s that was hijacked, and uh, they let all the passengers off. I forget which one it was, and they crashed the plane, and the only two cases that were intact from the plane crash were a pair of Zero Halliburtons like this. You can buy the Pluck Foam for like eight bucks on eBay. All I had to do was clean this case inside and out. Buy ten dollars of pluck foam, so for a total of sixty bucks, and of course you buy these used. There's right now there's a huge one on eBay with four roller wheels on the bottom, and they want like ninety bucks for it. It's got a few dents in it, but I mean it'd be perfect for storing a crap load of gear. The only downside to a zero Halliburton is that uh, if you store it in a zero Halliburton, anybody that comes into your house will know. You know there's some expensive shit in that case. <laughs> That'd be the first thing they want to steal is the Zero Halliburton. It's uh, actually uh, pulled from a, a single sheet and uh, then heat treated of solid aluminum. These are actually made in the United States back in Jersey. It started out as Halliburton, excuse me, yeah, started out as Halliburton and then Zero Bottom, I forget when, and, and a Japanese company called Ace owns them. They still make cases like this. So I bought this for 45 bucks used, which is pretty cheap, $10 shipping. Do you know how much a new one of these costs? They still make them today, but the new ones are not made as good. A new one will cost you, like this, $550, $600? Yeah, they got rubber O-ring gaskets on the inside. They actually have feets, but feets? I said feets? What's wrong with me? I think I said feets. Um, you can actually change the combination by flipping a switch back here and changing the combo. It's very easy to do, but uh, there you go. What a better place to store GFX medium format lenses than here. Obviously, this is not a location case. We call this a storage case. This is, you would not show up on a photo gig with a zero Halliburton. Well, you might, and someone would be like, Jesus, where the hell did you get that old case? You know, there's no improving on perfection. And these were perfected in the 1940s. Yeah, when they actually added the ribs instead of just plain flat aluminum. You can't improve on perfection. No, so. I love it when people say old shit about stuff that was perfect like a hundred years ago. Not a hundred years on this, but it's like, yeah, well, what, do you, what do you want to compare it to? It's a... Uh, it's, uh, Rubber gasket sealed, it's solid aluminum. It has a, uh, a settable combination. It's absolutely the epic tits and the cat's ass. What are, you, what are you complaining about? New one's almost 600 bucks, I bought this for 50 bucks. What you bitching about? People love to complain about everything, especially on YouTube. Anyway, there's one of my secrets, a Zero Halliburton.